In this video, we will cover how to implement the Klarna Express button on your website. The Express button can be integrated in three easy steps, which include adding the Express button script, adding the button element on the cart page, and finally, implementing the async callback to capture the user details shared by Klarna. To best showcase a real-world environment, we will implement the Klarna Express button in our demo store. Step 1. Including the Klarna Express script in the head tag. Let's create a script tag and include the required parameters. Source, the URL of the Klarna Express button library. Data ID, the environment-specific merchant identifier. Data environment, the environment where the Express button is used. This can be playground or production. It's worth mentioning that this is optional and it defaults to production. And last, we need to add the async attribute because we want to fetch the script now and run it later when we need to. Step 2. Adding the Express button. Because we included the Klarna Express button script, we now have access to the Klarna Express button element. This is where the button gets rendered. Next, we need to pass in the required parameters, which are data locale, we will use NUS, refer to the documentation for supported localizations. Data team, it can be default, dark, or light. This parameter is optional, and if not included, the default theme will be used. Step 3. Implementing Klarna's async callback to receive the user details. To receive user details, we need to implement Klarna's async callback function. However, before we do this, let's take a look at how it works. When the button gets initialized, the Klarna Express button async callback gets called. And within this callback, we will listen to the Express button's user authenticated event. Once the user completes the Express button flow, this event gets called and will return our data. We will use this data to prefill shipping and billing information on our checkout page. The optimal location for the Express button is on the cart page, next to the main checkout button so that shoppers better understand how to use it. You can refer to our best practice guide to optimize it for your website. And now that we know how it works, we need to populate all the customer details with the data sent from Klarna and redirect the user to the last step of the checkout so that the user can complete the purchase. Now let's test if everything is working smoothly. And sure enough, it does. If you have questions about the Express button, don't hesitate to reach out. Our merchant support team is happy to help you with general questions at merchant.usa at klarna.com. Thanks for using Klarna and congrats on the smart new addition to your cart page. We look forward to building a lot of success together.